Hello everyone and welcome back to Harvest Moon Magical Melody. Last episode we had some very bad weather. We had to save scum a bit to win the uh, the swimming festival. That's okay. We're back on we're back on task now. The only thing that's a bummer is it made it feel like nothing happened. But we got a power berry. Which is not nothing. Alright, I need to start paying attention to the weather just so I can maybe prepare. Alright, we need to... We need to water our crops first. Basically get rid of all our chores done. As fast as possible. Because I think it's at like 10 a.m. The sun starts beating down. Can I... Oh... I didn't know I could pick things up while while holding a tool. Uh, someone had, had mentioned that I could mine. That you can like pick up the things that you mine without. Is this the, is this efficient? I feel like it's not efficient. But someone had mentioned that I could mine and not have to like put away the hammer to pick up the uh, the ore because it would like it would disappear so fast. Uh, so now I, I can kind of see how that works. So that's good. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. All right, let's go take a, let's go take a look at oh our barn. I haven't seen that since the hurricane. I don't think or typhoon. All right, fill this up. All right, Dewey, guard this place. I don't trust the two inside at all. All right, I'm looking for some sort of like wild flower or a. Uh, maybe I'm... Uh, did I see mushrooms? Maybe I saw mushrooms. Hi, Makoto. You know what? Because I ignored you yesterday, I'm even going to feed you directly. I think I need to do some more fishing because I don't have enough stamina to cut grass. And I'm going to need that. I'm going to need that grass. So we're looking for a flower, a mushroom, or we do some fishing. I'm trying to th ah. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Give it. They booed me. I don't think the po I don't think she likes the poisonous ones. <laughs> Oops. I, now, now I know there's a bunch there, so if she does end up liking the mushroom, assuming I, flower would be my first choice, but I'm not seeing that as an option. All right, let's go, let's go fish. I know, shocking, we're gonna go fishing. When you use the tools, push the plus button to lock on. It's more convenient because you can move while you work. That is true. Yeah. How are you? There are all sorts of announcements on TV. Yep, you told me that before. Several times, in fact. I think if I don't waste a ton of stamina watering bad spots, I'm pretty sure I can get my grass cut and crops watered without having to resort to food. Oh my god. I do like the, that the fish seem to lock onto you a little bit better than they do in something like, say, Animal Crossing. And I do like... 
that I, I at least have an idea of if I can catch a fish when I cast. I don't know. Like, right now, I'm comparing a lot to Animal Parade just because that's uh, what I've been playing. But, like, in that game, you can cast and, and have, like, no idea if you're going to catch anything or if you can even do anything with what you caught. Um... Or like if you like you hook something, whether or not you're even gonna be able to reel it in. That's where I was going with that. Like there's a fish I had probably like 80% of my stamina left, and I, I hooked a fish and I started reeling it in, and thankfully the game doesn't let you pass out, but I basically just ran out of stamina. And the fish got away before I could uh, get it. I like that's crazy to me. I, it wasn't even like like, I had decent, decent fishing skill, and I had, like, a copper fishing rod. So, like, not, not the best, but it wasn't completely terrible either, so I was, I was not expecting that. I know I kind of made fun of the, uh, the, the floating knife thing. I do like that there's at least an animation, though, for cooking. Uh, I, think it, I think it works here where it's clear that, like, you aren't... At least it doesn't seem like you're really intended to just sit here and, like, cook over and over and over again like you are in, say, Story of Seasons. I decided in Animal Parade, I wanted to start because in Story Seasons you can make a like a winery and and make your own booze. So I was like, I want to do that in uh, Animal Parade, which the game you can make cocktails, but the, it it's definitely not quite as robust as the later entries. Alright, so I had to uh, put that out with the watering can. Does that, that part just go away on its own? Sure. I don't remember. I'm just going to leave it there because it's fine. Alright. Let's go to... Hi, Jamie. Well, do the best you can. I beat you at swimming the second time. So yeah, I was trying to make uh, the cocktails in Animal Parade, and you just make everything one at a time. You have to add each ingredient one at a time. Then it plays its little animation. So that uh, that took a little while. All right, what do I need for a chicken coop? Uh, new construction, we need a chicken coop. 30, we don't have 30. Can I buy... Lumber. 50, so I need, what, 15? That's fine. I know, I, I know it's probably more efficient to do it on my own, for sure, but... This lets me build it now. I re I really like that. Ugh. I really like that you could just buy lumber. Uh, it seems like such a like basic thing now. But that wasn't something you used to be able to do. Uh, I think I'm gonna put it there. I think is the way to go. Actually, I wonder if. I'm gonna put it there. We'll see. I'll probably regret that. That's fine. Like, I don't miss OG Harvest Moon. Going up and down the mountains. 
and chopping up stumps, which took six swings to break. Until you got the gold axe, I think, at like the end of your first year. So like basically halfway through the game. And so you get six uh, lumber. <laughs> Hello, my friend. I'm tired of this. I wonder how I can rake in some easy money. Stay away from me. How are you, my friend? I live at my own pace. I'm going to continue on, on in a laid back and leisurely way. Yeah. Are you going home? Take care. Yeah. Yo, Matrick, it's a pleasure to meet you. Uh, we met already. Oh, there's a mole! Get it! I have to go throw that away, don't I? But yeah, it just, it just basically took forever to get all that lumber. So you needed 500, so you were going, for the second house upgrade, you were going six at a time. Wait, are you... Grow up, oh, grow up healthy, okay. Never mind. That's like, that's almost a hundred, like just doing lazy math, that's like almost a hundred. Uh, tree stumps that you had to break. Ooh. Musical notes for... Oh, fodder. Harvesting the pastures to make fodder. A note of the sun's aroma. Okay. Oh, never mind. Oh, I lost a I lost a piece of grass. Alright, that's fine. Cool. Where is the bar? I think it was this way. Yes. What time are you open? 6 p.m. Okay. We have an hour. Let's go see what we can find. Ooh, what's this? It's locked. Ah! Jamie Ranch. Unauthorized personnel not allowed. Clearly. Go. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to upset. I didn't mean to upset your animals. No, I guess the stranger showing up. Oh. Good doggy. You look friendly. Those are the right herbs. Cool. Let's go in. At some point, I want to time it out and see how long the days are. Or, like, how quickly time goes by. What do you want? I don't feel like talking right now. Good evening. Nothing better than a fish than a fish as a snack. There are plenty of other things I'd prefer, but whatever. Being committed to work is an important thing. Hi. Good evening. I must work hard and save up money. Uh, alright. You like these in the last game? Please like them now. <laughs> I like- yes! <laughs> Thank you. There were very few gift options in the original. Good evening. <laughs> I like people who tell interesting stories. Still want to meet more of the bachelorettes before we decide on one, but that's going to be Eve is going to be hard to beat, uh, purely for nostalgia. All right, let's go find more mushrooms. Let's go get all the mushrooms, stock them in our fridge, so that way we can just grab one each day. Uh huh. I almost ate that. I don't have any more room. Ah, oh, there's Nami. I want to talk to you, but I have no room to put down the thing that I'm holding. <gasps> oh, oh, I want that. Oh my god. I'm hoping that if I pick it up in time, that maybe that, like, undoes the damage. Otherwise, that's, that's pretty rough. That was something I did with uh, Story Seasons, I did it with uh, 
Animal Parade. What other one did I do that with recently? I want to say Wonderful Life, maybe? Where I like timed how long, like how fast time passes basically. Because I haven't really paid attention to that since like the original when it was 15 seconds was an hour. And what I was kind of surprised to find out. Oh, mushroom can't go in the toolbox. It goes in the fridge. Is that both of those games move at the same rate? I would not have suspected that. Um. No, let's. There you go. In the trash. And then you get shipped. Cool. I'll put the other uh, mushroom in the fridge. Because I felt like having like playing them both sim like simultaneously, it felt like Animal Parade's days went by slower. So when I when I saw that time moved at the exact same speed in both games, that really surprised me. Uh, until I started like looking at the little things, like the fact that when you're charging a tool, time doesn't go by. Uh, in Animal Parade, when you're inside in Animal Parade, time doesn't go by. Oh, we can get a chicken now. I finished the assigned work. I still feel like they're getting ready to just like beat me up. <laughs> just through these three random guys just show up at your house first thing in the morning. So yeah, when you add in those things, it does- Ooh, a festival. What festival? I'd like to actually participate in a festival. Oh, that means the shops are closed. Star festival. Go float bamboo boats with wishes. I'm assuming the beach. Which sucks. We can't give a gift to Eve then, because the bar isn't going to be open. Anything grow? Nope. That was that was corn in the middle. I think because of the earlier Harvest Moon games, I always take for granted that corn grows uh or not grows the fastest. Is it worth the most? are growing. I really like that trees don't take forever to grow. I know it's way more realistic that to have them take like 30 days or 60. But considering that in a lot of games they don't even sell you seeds. Like, until the month that tree comes around, that means that you're not getting anything out of it until the next year. So I like that even though I'm not going to get a ton out of it this year, at least I get something. It's locked. What time do you normally open? Uh, Thursdays and holidays. Alright, so everything everything's just going to be closed. We're not going to be able to do much. Let's go check on our cow. I'm always gonna peek my head inside the chicken coop. Uh, here, have some fodder. Oh, it doesn't grow back every day. I don't think I noticed that before because I wasn't out chopping every day. Check out the chicken coop. Maybe free chicken? No. Alright, I'm curious about something. Alright, 
Where is my... Right? Map is kind of wonky to work around. I wish I was in an area where I could just get a bunch of land around me. So that way, all my, all my stuff is like centrally located. I don't think that's going to be possible. Uh, someone did confirm to me that I, I apparently picked the right plot of land. So there was, you know, I had that going for me. How much inventory space do I have? Uh, three? Okay. So I could grab those things. I don't see anything going on. I have a feeling it's a nighttime festival. Might as well make a little bit of cash picking things up. I'd like to go find some herbs. I'm wondering if at any point, like, people will tell you what to ship to get more people to move in. I wouldn't even necessarily mind that. But I have a, I have a feeling it's probably just you're supposed to, to guess and just start shipping things and, and hope someone shows up. one way or the other as far as like people already being in the town or, or taking time to show up I think it just depends on how it's implemented like it felt like it took forever for licorice and Camille to show up in story of seasons it felt like it took a little while to get the uh, witch princess in Animal Parade. That one, it's... There's like kind of a lock on it and kind of not. Like I'm pretty sure the earliest, like the absolute earliest you can have her show up is early summer. Because one of the, one of the items you need to get her to show up doesn't grow until summer and you can't buy it. really wore me out. <laughs> Not all those farm chores. <laughs> Just picking that one thing up. <gasps> what is this? What? I don't know what that is. I'm putting that in my... I'm putting that in the fridge. Well, hold on to that. It's probably it's probably like a, a random wildflower that's worth 20 gold, but still. I don't see them growing all over the place. I have to assume that they're rare. And I've learned to pick up the berries and that kind of stuff because you can turn them into liquor in other games. I'm trying to decide when, like when we're kind of wrapping up with this, like maybe not necessarily finished, but as we start wrapping up. Oh, I have mail. Uh, I, I want to get input on which game to play next. And I haven't quite decided how I want to go about doing that if I want to do like do I want do I want to pick the games first and and like nominate them and and then have you guys vote or do I want to have you guys nominate first
because sometimes it'll come up like someone will just mention a game and it's like I never would have, have thought of that um, but at the same time you, you don't want to ever get, like get stuck playing something that you don't want to play so I feel like if I at least you know decide all right I'm, I'm cool with the this set of games you guys pick which one I, I feel like that's maybe the stronger way to go I mean another part of that too is that maybe like a bunch of people say play Harvest Moon 64 it's like, oh, that one wasn't on my list, but if a lot of people want to see it, th then that at least like puts it on my radar. So yeah, I haven't decided quite how I want to do that yet. Where I was going with that is I, th I think today's question of the day is which Harvest Moon game would you most want to see someone play o outside of Magical Melody? Because I'm, I mean, I'm assuming everyone's here because they like Magical Melody. So which, uh, which other ones? would you want to see like completely independent of any statements I've made about the games where is this festival like I know I've spoken uh, pretty poorly of save the homeland uh, I haven't played a new leaf, but I from what I understand it's just like save the homeland plus But like just completely disregard that like which one would you like to see someone play? Don't know where this festival is It's locked so I can't do anything and I don't know where to go. Ah, <laughs> this is not great. Mayor's house. It's locked. There's lights on. Is he is he ducking me? I would have thought the beach. Maybe the speech. I don't see. I don't see people anywhere on the map. That's disappointing. And I swear, like, even early Harvest Moons would, like, tell you where the festival was. Granted, most of them were at one place, but still. It's kind of surprising that it's thrown up on the calendar. It's like, yeah, yeah, you'll figure it out. I probably should have talked to the mayor. If the, if I can be faulted for one thing, that's probably it. All right. Yeah, that's where we're going to end for today. Uh, so let me know, uh, in the comments, just let me know which, uh, which Harvest Moon you would most want to see after this. And I can kind of start, start stewing on it. How are we, how are we even doing on music notes? Oops, didn't mean to do that. See if we're even, we have 20 out of 100. Alright, so we got a long ways to go. So, I mean, it doesn't have to be anything... Don't, you know, don't kill yourselves too much thinking about it, but just, just throw it out there. Let me know what you guys would like to see. Uh, as always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.